So Richie, yes. what do you think about the Gurkhas? Uh, they're very, very good people, number one. They're very, number two, they're good fighters. Nobody will monkey around with them, nobody. Even the Japanese stay far away from them. And uh, they have a knife, it's more like a sword. It, it's, it's called got, kukuri. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's straight up and then it got a curve to it. Gherkin, they call it a gherkin knife. And uh, I, I heard that with one stroke, they can cut you in two pieces. That's true. Because first uh, they lop off your head, and they come and they come around with the same stroke, and they get your midsection. Wow. Well, there's no bones there in midsection. Right. Okay, and they come out straight to the other side, and you're in three pieces. Wow. Your chest, your bottom part, and your head. Very tough people. Nobody mucks you around with them. Nobody. Yeah. Did you see any of those incidents though? Oh no, I, mean, I didn't see You them. heard about it? Yeah. yeah, I heard about that, yeah. And, they're, and they're, they're, they're very fierce looking, man. You can't look at them in the face. Forget about it. You gotta look somewhere else. <laughs> so very, you got... Very tough people. Now they, they're okay if you leave them alone. If you monkey around, forget about it. You're finished. Other than Gurkhas in the World War II, because you were in the World War II too, right? Well, they didn't, uh, they didn't do any fighting alongside with us. Maybe with the English, I don't know. That's when I was in Burma, okay? What were you doing in Burma? I was in Michinar, Michinar, Burma. Uh, right near the Irrawaddy River. And uh, I was with the 504th Light Pontoon Engineers. And we made a makeshift ferry we used to go across that river. And that river, if you ever fall in that water, you're finished. Wow. It can't save you because the current is very swift. You're gone in no time. And if that doesn't kill you, the coldness of the water will kill you. You get hypothermia, whatever it's called, <laughs> right? You know? I see three Chinese soldiers go sailing down so fast. They went, they went out like from here to the curb over there. What is that, bud? 30 feet? Should they be. were gone. The, shit, the, the current got them. <coughs> a very bad place, bro, I tell you. How old are you now, Rich? 91. You're 91? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> All respects for My you, man. My birthday was uh, uh, October 10th. Libra. Libra. Yeah. You're right about the Gurkhas, though. Yeah. How'd you know? Because my dad is a Gurkha. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, oh. he's a Gurkha. <laughs> yeah. They make, they, they, whatever they might make is worthwhile buying. Right. I like what, the way they make things. And, and they don't rob you. They, they make something and it, it it works. It's, it's, it's very good. And they don't rob you with the price either. Very good. Yeah. But the Chinese, they make garbage. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, they make shit to some bitch. I got a, at a 99 cent store, I bought uh, slippers. They look like moccasins. I said, oh shit, they gotta be good, you know? <laughs> I bought them. When I got home, I, I wore them for a while. Then I said, I never looked to see what kind of material it's made. I look, what do you think it's made from? Rubber. Can you imagine freaking rubber? I, what the hell they make a slip of that for, you know, out of rubber? Oh my God, it's supposed to be leather. Well, you know, it's got to breathe, you know? Right. Otherwise, it's going to sweat. Thank you, Richie. Hmm. Cheers. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs>